Hey guys, so today we start with some massive news regarding the Galaxy Note release. This comes from Ice Universe. He tweeted saying Galaxy Note with an image attached that said the end. This most likely means that this year we will not see a Galaxy Note 21 and that the last Galaxy Note was the Galaxy Note 20. There is a bit of confusion in that sense if Samsung makes a Galaxy Note 21 or if Samsung will not make a Galaxy Note 21 and will only make the Galaxy C Fold 3, which we expect will have the S Pen inside the device along some other things like the under display camera and the glass display. So it will be very interesting to see what ends up happening. We expected the Galaxy Note 21 to be released in June or July because Samsung has moved up a lot of releases compared to last year. So we will have to wait and see what happens if Samsung ends up releasing a Galaxy Note device this year or if they instead replace it with the Galaxy C Fold 3 as the higher end model and the Galaxy S21 Ultra, which has S Pen support as the new Note. So it will be very interesting to see and it will be very exciting to see what Samsung announces in the coming months and if they release a new type of product. Alongside this, today we also have a new trademark for what it will be the under panel camera or UPC. This trademark was given to Samsung and the trademark mentions that it is for a smartphone display and a TV display panel. So we could be seeing Samsung TVs with under display cameras and we will also see smartphones with the under panel camera. The first one of course is expected to be the Galaxy C Fold 3. So it will be very exciting to see how Samsung implements the under panel camera, if the technology is good enough and on what devices Samsung will implement the under panel camera. It is very exciting to see the advancements Samsung has made with the under display camera and we're months away from seeing Samsung first under panel camera, which will be the Galaxy C Fold 3. And lastly for today, we have an invitation for a Motorola release on January 26, this is for the Motorola Edge S, which will be a new variant of the Motorola Edge series. And the Motorola Edge S will be powered by the new Snapdragon 875 g Basically, the Snapdragon 870 is like a Snapdragon 865++. It is an overclocked Snapdragon 865+. The Motorola Edge S has a very similar design to previous Motorola phones like the Moto G 5G Plus and the new Motorola One Ace 5G, a 64 megapixel main camera, 16 megapixel ultra wide angle camera, and a dual 5 megapixel macro and depth sensor alongside what is expected to be a glass back. On the front, the Motorola Edge S has a 16 megapixel selfie camera and an 8 megapixel ultra wide angle camera. The expected price point of the Motorola HS is around five to six hundred dollars and will be released on January 26. So stay tuned for that. There is a lot of phones coming with this new chipset from Sony, Vivo, Oppo, and Xiaomi. Also preparing to release phones with the new Qualcomm Snapdragon 470. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. Stay tuned because there is a lot more information regarding the Motorola HS the Galaxy C Fold 3 and what will happen to the Galaxy Note 3s.